Mr. Again, President, uh, of course the multi-financial framework uh, is uh, a bit out of date and has shortcomings uh, because of COVID and the Ukraine war. Now, the, the report acknowledges that 21.9% of the EU population is at risk of poverty and social inclusion, and the energy poverty is certain to worsen as a consequence of the war. But what's the EU doing to end the war? Absolutely nothing. We're flooding Ukraine with arms to make sure that it doesn't stop at a great cost to our own citizens and at great cost to the lives of so many Ukrainians. Now, paragraph 39 of the report calls for an increase in the budget ceiling for security and defence. It advocates spending more money on weapons and war, money that could be spent instead on climate mitigation and adaptation, public transport, health or education. There is no military solution to the crisis in Ukraine. And the policy of flooding Ukraine with weapons is madness. And if we want to fight Russia down to the last Ukrainian and make our own people suffer in the meantime, just to support a US-NATO proxy war, it's about time we copped on to ourselves.